world was poppin' B She really wanna be the one to rock with me Then grab the cuffs and lock it Don't knock it, but please don't copy me What's up y'all, it's Valentine, back with another video where we check out music and give our thoughts and opinions on it. Today we're checking out Joker by Dax, which is brand new, and I'm super excited to check it out because it seems like, uh, from the small clip of it that I've watched, a very emotionally laced track because he mentions at the beginning about cyberbullying and things uh, like that. And as y'all know, if y'all follow my channel, I love all things mental health, so I'm actually really excited to see what he has to say on this topic and to see what this track is about. Um, so I won't hold up too much to talk about other things. So let's go ahead and get into the video. Y'all know I got my water. I got my backup water. I got my backup backup water. Let's see what Dax has got for us today. This is what I was talking about. 90% of cyberbullying attempts uh, or victims attempt suicide. I don't know how true that st statistic is, but make it up. This is as far as I've seen. Smoking man, I'm sick. But I think you know that already. You call me evil, but how would you know it unless you live it already? You think you're better, right? Cause nobody's seen what you've done in the dark. But if I put your life in this light, you would crumble and fight to survive or die. But bitch, I fucking knew that already. I ain't special. But I specialize in making you feel especially stupid for judging a human while you sit at home and the whole world can't watch what you're doing or follow and hate all your movements. I ain't complaining, but I know the people who do it are sicker than me and I'm sick enough to fight my losers. Before we get into the, the real meat of the song there, so starting off really, really heavy, he's doing a big call out towards the people that are watching. Uh, probably like uh, specifically the people that probably comment negative things on posts online. Um, I'm betting that's what this is about, um, because that's something that tends to affect artists a lot. I mean, I could be totally wrong, to be honest with you, but that's something that I could see being a topic that he would touch on as the type of character that he is. Um, so, so yeah, a really big call out towards the people that are watching this, uh, really mentioning how, how like he, he sees, you know, he feels similar to the way that they do. He's got a gun in his hand. He's got Joker face paint on. Also, this video is very well edited um, already, like just from, from a second ago when he did the did the smile Look part, the end, like right, right, right here at the end. Smoking man, I'm sick. But oh, I dig that. Like that was really well done. Um, so anyway, let's continue with the song, but like so far digging in the track. Hate all your movements. I ain't complaining, but I know the people who do it are sicker than me and I'm sick enough to fight my losers. Yeah, you think you know me because you double tap on a picture. I hate the fact that you judge me. It's driving me crazy. So when it's too deep, I say fuck it and drown in some liquor. I write these verses in blood. I got chapters for days. My heart is a biblical scripture and I ain't a prophet, but I can predict that you'll never catch happiness till you the picture. So please continue to laugh. If I'm a clown, you a circus act. But now I rap it's in a surge's mask. Because I place every syllable in a deliverable fashion from first to last. And cut back. With the message that's hidden in melody, making them think and ask If I was the one on the table pushing, giving birth to rap Maybe it was me, maybe you like all my music but don't really actually love me Maybe you just want a picture, maybe you just want to see me cause you need some money Maybe you think that I'm happy, maybe you think in reality Liking my post, repairing a home and it's actually shaking and cutting the soul right out of me I think Oof. So yeah, very heavy, uh, heavy topics here where uh, he's talking about like, like how he's he's really in general like upset and he's not he's not happy and then like there's people that like act like they support him and really in reality like it's either for the fame the fortune just to be as uh you know just to be at like they're close to him stuff like that like it's hard and i don't think that that's to say that that's what these people all want but it's to say that this is like he's he's reached a point in his in his come up in his fame where he doesn't know who to trust right um which is incredibly hard for a lot of people to go through uh, in general. And I know that's especially something that happens to people who is, who slowly get famous over time. Anyway, let's continue. I'm sick. I feel a rush of emotion whenever I post up a pic. I got a problem. I'm in the studio rapping while this girl is sucking my dick. She got a <laughs> hole in my heart and I feel it with women who love me because they think I'm rich. And if Ooh. I'll be honest, I just was a bitch and I care, but I really do not give a shit. So what's your excuse? What helps you sleep? You leave a negative comment not knowing what you sow, you will reap. You're insane. You're in pain. I can tell by what you're saying. 
my bad. I forgot you were fragile. I forgot someone who doesn't even know me told you I'm an asshole. I forgot okay. that I'm the villain. I forgot okay. that I've always spread positivity, but uh -huh. you think I didn't. I forgot that hatred stems from people who hate their own existence. I forgot I'm better off alone. I forgot I care for everyone's happiness, but forget about my own. I forgot I spend every waking second on my phone. <laughs> before we get into that so so he's a good actor by the way like like dax for next joker um so this this really touched on a lot of things uh and i love that he's kind of like doing a self call out with it with this slower part that's uh got a lot more emotion because it's like he he's really tacking on like you know this is what y'all do that are wrong, but here's here's kind of like what I do that's wrong that y'all do the same thing of like, and then it's like, oh, that's right, I forgot I'm these things, uh, and then also he's he's calling out other people for thinking things of him uh, that he's not really like he's saying like how he forgot that he's the bad guy, he forgot that um what that like someone that that y'all didn't even know said he was bad, so y'all are just believing that person, um so it's like really like a call out at different people I, I don't know i love this type of stuff like like specifically like i forgot that i'm a villain i forgot that i've always spread positivity but you think i didn't yeah i forgot that i've always spread positivity but you think i didn't um so he's saying that he's a very positive person and he's influential but people don't see that because all they see are like the things that he's done wrong or things that other people have said that he's done wrong so like like it's really it's really a self-emotional song i dig this type of stuff I forgot that hatred stems from people who hate their own existence. I forgot I'm better off alone. I forgot I care for everyone's happiness, but forget about my own. I forgot I spend every waking second on my phone. <laughs> Come join my circus. The last night bad. I'm recruiting. I'm taking everyone who passes judgment, bitch. That's including everyone who thinks it's so amusing. About me down while I'm pursuing. The keyboard warriors that live online behind. So if you fail to land a flip, you can feel what I felt when you tried to come sink my ship. Let me explain, you all help me financially gain. I spend my money on mental health books and read them just to control all my pain. I don't wear clothes, but bought this chain, and just like you, this chain is fake. I wear it to distract you from the blatant sadness written on my fucking face. What'd you expect? Damn. Did you think I wasn't mute to what you were saying and didn't see all of the disrespect? Do you think I'm not human, have no feelings? Or maybe you think I'm fucking weak and now I'm pleading. Maybe you think I'm just too good and that I'm fucking cheating. Or maybe, just maybe, you're blind and the hate inside your heart clouds your eyes and your mind and your ears when I rhyme, even though we all know I'm one of the best of all time. Time. Or maybe you're just a fucking bitch and I can Stop comparing me to people who are not in my league. Stop saying I don't believe in God just because you can't read. Stop making fake profiles so you can spam my feed. I'm not alone. I know there's millions out there just like me. <laughs> very big like, call to the joke or like with this track. Like very, very well put together video of him just losing it, right? This would be really fun to act. I don't know, y'all. I don't think I can bring the intensity that the Joker brings. But anyway, that... Ooh, and it's got the suicide prevention hotline here. So that's that's real. So, you know, maybe dude is, like, really depressed. Um, I mean, it would make sense because, you know, a lot of people that present themselves as, like, really, like... It, well, that tend to be called out for having delusions of grandeur are people that actually feel really negatively about themselves. And people don't realize it because what they're doing is presenting themselves as a person that they want to be but not a person that they really are and that person that they want to be or that they think is the ideal version of themselves is really arrogant and, and self-centered um which isn't isn't real but it's it's what a lot of people especially not to say everybody with depression but a significant amount of people with depression myself included believe that I believe is normal you know what i mean like to really care about yourself have really positive self-image like for the longest time i believe that was the norm and that everybody just had like this really positive self-image unless they had depression um 
and that's really not the case. I mean, everybody has their own negatives and their own negative self-image. Um, even really, like, not arrogant, but really positive people have that own negatives to their self-image and who they are as a person. Um, it just, it's, it's, it's weird to, to look at, like, like, you know, mental health stuff and, like, the stuff like depression and stuff like uh, people that don't suffer from these, these uh, things um, and think of it like it's not it's not that i see myself as lower because i have depression it's more so that i see myself as different at least for me and speaking on my own experience it's because a lot of my stuff was like was like really insecurity driven i feel like um but i don't know it's just you think different when you when you have all different stuff going on in your mind um and i think it's perfectly normal especially like to have mental health issues um it's normal there's a lot of people with them so it's nothing to be ashamed of it's just a matter of uh just a matter of like where you go with them you know how much you let them control you and some people have have harder uh, paths to walk than others and that's just kind of a thing and it sucks but you know one day i hope that People will stop turning a blind eye to mental health issues and actually start doing something about it. Anyway, I went off on a tangent. Let's get back to the track. What did y'all think of Joker by Dax? I think it was a really, really well put together video. Um, I think it was a really great, um, really great uh, video that like really touches on some some heated topics, some important topics, some very self relevant topics for him as an artist in this genre. Uh, and I think the video was really well put together, like the editing and everything. It was really, really great. Um, so what did y'all think? Definitely leave in the comments and let me know what y'all thought because I love hearing your guys' responses. We're now at 600 subscribers, so we're really moving up there, guys. Let's get to 1,000 soon. Uh, super excited. I'm thinking about holding some sort of contest or something uh, at 1,000, so let me know in the comments if y'all guys would be interested in that. Um, and let me know what you thought about the track. What was your favorite line? What was the best thing about it? Let me know other tracks you want me to check out. Please feel free to hit subscribe and click the bell for notifications if you haven't already. And be sure to check out other videos floating over my shoulders right now that link you to other stuff on the channel. I would love to have you guys check those out as well. Uh, I appreciate you guys checking out the video and I will see y'all on the next one.